Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Young Researchers. In today's video, we will discuss about an interesting uh, topic, how to check uh, self-citations and how we can check the self-citation of our co-authors. For example, in Google Scholar profile, uh, your number of citations are different, while in Scopus, your um, citations are different because some of the published papers, they are not indexed by Scopus, so they will not appear on your Scopus profile, while on the Google Scholar, they, the number of uh, published papers is generally uh, higher. Uh, or more than your Scopus paper. Also, um, for example, if um, you cite your previously published paper in your own papers or if some other co-author um, of your paper, they cite um, uh, published their own published paper in uh, their new paper as a reference, then it is not ethically uh, incorrect if only uh, the subject of a new paper, it relates with the previously paper published, they can cite. But if it is of totally uh, different topic, for example, if the new paper is about some biological issue and if they are citing some water treatment reference, then it is eth ethically not correct. And also, during submission process, general administrator and editor, they check the uh, either all the references are correct or not, or if there is any inappropriate reference in uh, that you cite in your paper. So make sure to add only the relevant references uh, in your paper. So. Uh, the question here is how we can check that how many um, authors other than uh, us or all our co-authors they cited our paper like excluding self citation so the best way is to go to the scopus profile for this you if you have linked your uh, elsewhere reviewer hub with the scopus profile you can also go uh, from elsewhere reviewer hub scopus profile and then you, you can click on this profile and uh, scopus profile will be opened so if um, uh, you want to um, go directly from Google you can write uh, like a, a Scopus uh, login on Google and then from there you can log into your Scopus profile so first of all um, uh, for example if I want to check my uh, citations on the Scopus on the Scopus that are excluded uh, my self citation or the self citation of all co-authors then what I have to do I will go from here like search option So for search option, uh, you need to select here like which thing you want to search. For example, if I want to um, search the authors, then I will click on uh, authors and then I will uh, click write their name here like Mariam Batool and I will go to search option. take some time to load um, the profile here you can see an option of uh, export download citations overview and uh, all other things so all these uh, like papers related to this author will appear and if I want to uh, if I go back uh, to this and I will click on um, like it will show all the documents that are um, written by Marie Matul and if I want to click on authors and then I will add first uh, last name and uh, first name of author like this one and I click on search option only the profile of this author will appear okay so in this way you can um, open the documents of the researcher as well and for citation overview uh, you just need to go to author and then you need you can write the last name and the first name of the author after that um, all the authors that are um, that have the same name the searches will appear here so you also need to um, um, cross check the affiliation of uh, um, that author as well so this is the affiliation of me and this is my name and i will click on this tick and from here when i uh, take this option here you can see an option of citation overview and once i click on citation overview all the citations record of um, uh, this researcher will appear and uh, here you can see uh, the total number of documents that appear on scopus profile and the citations number of citations on scopus and the h index that is related or linked to my scopus profile 
and i am uh, i'm uh, i'm always saying like this uh, number of documents number of citations and h index of your scopus profile is always different from your uh, google scholar profile because some of the journals that are recently um, uh, opened like some of the elsevier journal or some of the other uh, journals that are recently opened they um, they are not indexing scopus immediately so it will take some time for them to be indexed by scopus okay so here you can see the citations overview uh, per year of this researcher and uh, here um, the total number of documents and citation and or h index you can see and it is uh, showing that this research paper has citation total number of citations like this one uh, per year it is showing like all the record here okay so if i want to exclude myself citations so the number of citations will decrease for example if i exclude self citations of selected author like if i uh, exclude self citations of me only like selected author mean mariam batul is here so the uh, number of citations will decrease so if i you want to exclude the self citations of all co authors like for example if your co author ap they also um, um, cite their paper uh, in their new um, publish uh, publish paper then you can also exclude self citations of all co authors then you can check the actual citations okay so in this way uh, for determining the actual citations that you got from other researcher in the field you can go to scopus and then you can uh, go to the search and from that you can go to author and you can write the last name and the first name of the um researcher and then you can click on this and go to citation overview and you can check the complete citation record uh, doc number of document citation and h index of the researcher okay so this is the um way to check the overall uh, citation record of any uh, researcher so in this way um, it is um, like uh, as i will repeat like the number of citations on the scopus will be different from that in google scholar so if you don't want to exclude the self citations uh, you can untick this and the number of citations will be different so um, this is all about uh, today's video in coming video we will discuss about how you can uh, um, check the um, either the journal files within the scopus or not so uh, like some of the journals like uh, they are not indexed by scopus so how you can uh, overview that from your scopus profile so till then allah hafiz